Oh yeah, cool. Five hits. No big deal. Yeah, just you know, just go ahead and just go ahead and do that. I guess I'll just crit you for like the fifth time since catching you. Uh, is like, it an is it an Izakai? Yes. Uh, uh, no, don't let that don't let that turn you away. Uh, no, do not. Uh, I'm, I'm serious. I'm, does I'm it? A, yeah. Does it do anything well with the fact it's an Izakai? Or no? In what way? Um, just the relevance of it being an Izakai in the first place, or is it just Hard, like hardly? There, I mean, there are there is a there is one plot thread that is relevant. But mm. I don't even think it comes into play until the second half of the first season. There's only one season right now. Season two has been announced and it's going to come out this year. Can't wait for that. But Pokemon Misty Dungeon, it's an Izakai. It is. <laughs> it's crazy. I, I am serious, though. Give it a shot. Yeah, if I find time to watch anime, I don't watch that much anime. Yeah, I'm, like I just like, like I got I just got through saying I've only seen one in the entire like, last year. So, you know, I'm there, too. Hey, signal beam. Let's go. I think it's just because I've grown so tired of. Very cliche anime tropes. Mm. I don't know if there's They'll ever. Be I don't know if there's ever one. any fully avoiding that. It's just how well they can utilize them, rather than how yeah. like. Is it a? Is it? A, is it a? Is it a crutch or a template? Right. Yeah. It's um. Or when they like dig, or what like when an anime will dig super hard into using one trope all the time as a joke. Mm. It's just like, no, no. Or the biggest, the absolute, I will, I will pause and I will stop. Is your anime going to have fight scenes and are those fight scenes going to be interrupted by internal monologue? <laughs> yeah, that's a tough one, right? That's a tough one because that's usually them trying to translate well, I say usually like I would know, but it seems to me like that's them translating it from manga from where they manga. have those internal monologues. And you can't have the action going with with a with a voiceover on top. Yeah. I mean, you, 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 yeah. you can and you should find a way to make that work because that's what's actually happening. But yeah, when it's like the action just pauses for the monologue to happen, it's like. Yeah, I don't know. Like, you're, you're, you're spending five actual seconds or ten actual seconds being like, what am I going to do? And you just see whoever they're fighting just standing there. Mm -hmm. Okay, okay. Charge beam. Yeah, I tried getting into Demon Soul or Demon Soul? Demon Slayer. Demon Souls. <laughs> Demon, Demon Souls, Demon Souls yes. Slayer. Demon Souls Slayer. Demon Slayer. But I think... Episode one or episode two was just nothing but that for 30 minutes. I was like, OK, I'm out. Interesting. And then I was just like, no, the, no, the anime gets better. I'm just like, no, I'm not. I'm not. I'm good. Hmm. Isn't it raining right now? I have nothing to fear from the semi seer. You know what? I didn't consider the fact that it could. OK, it just it just hit two times. We're fine, but it's faster than me. So actually, this Electro Ball is going to do nothing. Yep. 
I guess I should also say very specifically internal monologuing. Yeah. If a character is monologuing to an opponent because they're being egotistical and that's their downfall, that's funny. I can accept that. But if they're just to themselves in their head, wasting time, I'm just like, yeah, no. Uh, I mean, it's it's gonna happen. Actually, surprised to see no starter on your team. Technically, we still have him, have her. Yeah, the, our our duot. But yeah, we're not using it. All right, we're not using duot. Uh, we're gonna go catch something else when we get surf. Yeah, we've had we played um or a full all team the of previous. six. So okay, so the reason why you don't see a full team of six is because we planned out our team ahead of time. Each of us picked three Pokemon, and those are outside of using the starter up until we caught another Pokemon and the third gym where we had to bust out the uh, the, the, the okay. Panzer <laughs> because otherwise we weren't getting through that without grinding. Uh, we're only using the the six. We've had, um, we played pre the previous games and we had a few that had the starter. Uh, yeah, we did. Yeah. Um, but for this think, one, yeah, we had Typhlosion in Soul Silver. We used it was a Blaziken. Blaziken and yeah, we used Sapphire. Blaziken. Uh, and we, I think we used Torterra and Brilliant Diamond. Yeah. But then did I think we, we used Torterra. Oh I yes, was your pick. Yeah. Um, mm -hmm. and then I and then I think we didn't use a starter in Fire Red. So this is, the, I think, only the second game where we're not using the starter. The start isn't... Uh, start is in Kanto, make it easy. Oh, high triple battle. Oh, neat. this i probably did ask this you haven't played explorers of sky yet on on stream we did have you yes we actually did the entire post game on that one too oh wait yes i was there what am i talking about <laughs> i mean not there but i was in i was yeah. in chat yeah Super is the fourth? Super is the fourth. I mean, fourth North American. We don't, we don't, we don't acknowledge. I'm, talk, I'm talking about the wee ones. We don't, we don't acknowledge those. <laughs> Is gonna die. Probably. And he gone. a fight uh so when did when did full party exp shares start happening gen 6 
Gen 6, okay. So they just, Gen 6 and Gen 7 just made Pokemon more brain dead. Got it. Um, yes and no. Because you could also toggle it off. You could. I mean, look, if the game was balanced around it, then fine. But I don't think it's ever been properly balanced. Maybe Ultra Sun, Ultra Moon. What with mm -hmm. what, 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 what with the very difficult totem fights and Ultra Moon Cross. Mm -hmm. Made it easier to level up, but yeah, it's never really been balanced. Yeah. Yeah, it's probably the closest to being balanced in, in, uh, in Ultra Sun Ultra Moon, like I said. Uh, but I don't even think it was fully balanced there. I mean, it's Pokemon. They have to... They have to make the games for the lowest common... Not lowest common. For, for seven-year-olds. They have to make the games for seven-year-olds. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, that's there's no escaping that, but hmm. if only there was a difficulty setting. There was a difficulty setting in one generation, and it was so poorly implemented. <laughs> hey, do you want easy mode? Uh, yeah, that's why I played. Okay, Let's beat go. the game first. Wait, what? <laughs> Wait, what? Oh, did you not know? No, I didn't know that. What? So, white two, you get easy mode. Black two, you get hard mode. You can, you what? can, you can, you can unlock these in, in another game. Like you can, if a, bla a black two and a white two link up, they can trade their difficulties with each other and they're only unlocked after beating the game. Why? <laughs> <laughs> it's so bad. See, I didn't know that. I thought they were just like. Nope. Nope, the it's thing a, exist. No, no, that's it. It was. It's so bad. You could just have difficulty settings. See, okay, playing it again, but hard mode. I can completely. I'm okay with that. Yeah, unlocked, gym, gym but... leaders have extra Pokemon. I think they got better moves. They might have better hold items. Yeah, but there's also easy mode. Yeah, that's that's um, that's dumb. <laughs> Is that the is that the stupidest um game lock? What's, I the, what's the dumbest I lock? I still think I still think hiding sound settings behind talking to an NPC, even if it's like ultimately pretty benign, I still think that's the dumbest one. Oh no, yes, absolutely, that's the stupidest thing. But I meant like a game version lock, like difference inversion difference I don't know whichever Mega Man Battle Network has search man it was oh, it was a, I think it was a Battle Network one of the Battle Network fives just one of them having search man and one of them not having search man that's probably the biggest <laughs> uh, you think the most trouble with a champion is Cynthia and BDSP but but it's BDSP so just by like, just by virtue of playing the game, you have um, all of your Pokemon like a me maxed out, and uh, you just you just uh, survive at one HP on every hit. See, but you say that, but Cynthia destroyed you because In we BDSP. were too low level. I was skipping fights. Yes. Well, yes, but still. Like, my strategy was fine if Weavile had enough speed. But we were underleveled. So, I don't know. 
Honestly, BDSP wasn't a bad remake. Well, the The problem is it, just, it didn't do anything. It wasn't great. Like, yes, it didn't do anything exciting. So it was why literally just the carbon copy? But yeah, so why? So why remake fine. it? It was a why, not a not a this is bad. I would have liked it. I would have liked it just a little bit more if it was more like uh, the visual fidelity of Let's Go. That would have been a not, good style. So make it not cheapy. Get, give it, give it the Let's Go art style, and remake Platinum instead of Diamond Pro. That would have been like the best game on. That, that would have been like the best game on Switch. Yeah, why do they keep doing that? What would they call it though? I don't know. They'd name it something. Just something that makes sense to stick in front of platinum. Luminescent platinum. Renegade platinum? No, they'd never call it that. <laughs> no. Uh, iridescent is something that's typically call uh, used to describe pearls. So I wouldn't call it iridescent. Something relating to the Grissius Orb? Did you fight Joe yet? Interesting. Uh, I'll look out for him. <laughs> okay. Um, what they call it? Platinum. Nice I don't try. know. Nice try, chat. They get they get paid for it, but uh, yeah, should have just been platinum. But what do you um? What do you think the chances are they remake black and white? But um, not black and white too. Oh no. Ugh, higher than I'd like. <laughs> Just flat out. Here's the Mario All-Stars. Mario Galaxy 2 is not there. Oh man. Oh man. Pokemon Black and Pokemon White remake plus Bowser's Minions. Ugh. Yes. Yes. Rest in peace, Alpha Dream. It sucks that you had to be making 3DS remakes of Mario and Luigi when the Switch was already out. I wonder why you, your company died. Ed Cannon was Arceus was the Platinum remake. I mean, there was the the, Ar the Arceus or the the Giratina fight. That Giratina fight was pretty good. Uh, I would say actually, yeah, Arceus was a better alternative to BDSP, but. Eh. Oh, out of the two games, it was better, but yeah, it's it's not. It's so different. I want more games like it. But would you rather take a remake of a game or a new iteration of the, using that generation as a base? Like, give me, Black give me two give, exists, which. Uh, OK, so here. Yeah, so I see what you mean. Uh, yeah, make since since sequels already exist in Unova. Give me black and white three. <laughs> I mean, yes, you could do that. Or 
just I do would another, take, um, or just do another legends, please. I'll take I'll take Sun and Moon too. With Lily. Oh, they did Thank that. Just, they did that. It's called oh. Ultra Sun Ultra. <laughs> Can't even finish that sentence. <laughs> no. Uh, I'll take instead of a remake of an alt of Sun and Moon or Ultra Sun and Moon, just continue the story of Lily. Thank you. I'll take it. I'll, that I'll is that. not an Audino. So the 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 only problem with what you're suggesting, the only problem with what you're suggesting, is that it that would take place in Kanto, which is okay. It's it's okay if they don't just make Kanto again. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Kanto post gold and silver. That would be that'd be interesting. Like, do they do they fix uh Cinnabar? It, it doesn't even have to be um here we pick up on the other side of the boat. It, it could be past that point. I see. Tell us what happened through the story. Yes. Good environmental storytelling to see how the region was. Um, how the region changes. Because, because, you know, as as Pokemon fans, we've probably all already seen it. And to someone just playing the game, it won't matter anyway. So just have it be like, yeah, hints, environmental storytelling, all of the above. Fight me, graveyard people. Or not. Oh, here we go. Here's the, the graveyard people that fight. I mean, even just like... Um, the Alola region, but here, ten years later, yeah, Lily's back. Here, we can learn more about the story, about what goes on. I'll take that. Did or, or sorry, Just, you going to use the B trick? I have no idea what you're talking about. Anyway, what were you saying? Uh, just yeah, just because Sun and Moon, the story just felt unfinished. Yeah, like, yeah one okay. more one. Okay, so that that's what I that's what I thought you were getting at, chat. Um, turning the uh, turning the spinners. Uh, no, I'm just gonna fight everything. It's fine. Uh, yeah, yeah. Sun and Moon. Sun, sun, oh, light screen. Um. I think Sun and Moon could use a sequel. Yeah. Like more Guzma. Yes, please. Thank you. A lot more <laughs> Guzma. Yes, please. Um, yeah. Like what happens with Team Skull? Does Aether, does Aether squad get kicked out? You know, is it the same game that has the old man side quest? Old man side quest. Old man side quest. I don't know. If I know what that is, I have an idea. Oh, who's the problem? Hey, Lucas. Yep, yeah, there's a reason I've been kind of leaving Lucas at the front. All right, Galvantulud. You give an old man yes okay you give an old man a pokemon and it's implied it's implied it's not explicitly stated but it is very heavily implied that he uh, dies before he can give it back to you yes <laughs> so yeah uh -oh. that's in, that's in sun and moon got past n nice I don't, uh, what 
Where are we playing? What? Was it BDSP? What? You told... There was one thing about an NPC you told me about it and I was like, what? And I looked up and I was like, what? What was it? I can't... I can't remember. Are you talking Here's about... girl NPC. Oh, you're talking about Mindy? Mindy? Are you talking about Mindy? Let me see. Mindy Pokemon meme. Is that her? Yes. You know, Mindy, the very friendly NPC that trades you a Haunter. For, I don't even remember what she wants in return. And then the Haunter's holding an Everstone. <laughs> yes, okay, yes. You trade your Medicham for my Haunter. Medicham, yeah. Yeah. It's sent over. How very kind. And there's an entire suburb of just. Yes, there is. <laughs> yes. Yes, there is. <laughs> That's what it was. Yes. That's funny. Completely deserved. Oh, With well, people good. still posting in it as of like last month. That's funny. <laughs> Well, because BDSP happened. So it, it started all over again. Like it happened in it happened in in Diamond Pro Platinum, and then it happened again in Heart Gold Soul Silver. They put her in. She wasn't in Gold and Silver, but they put her in Heart Gold Soul Silver, and then that was the last we saw of her. Wait, she's in Heart Gold and Soul Silver. Silver? Yeah, I'm pretty sure she's in Blackthorn. Same trade. So she caught an another. She's evil. <laughs> and, 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 and now you see. <laughs> and, and, and then that was the last we saw of her until, you know, remix. And then it's, it started again. I think there's even somebody that tries like, like that pulls a Mindy in Scarlet Violet. Fun fact about Mindy, she has a decent amount of fan art. I yeah, I can see it. I can see that happening. Mm. She has a whole subreddit. <laughs> so <laughs> she doesn't have a subreddit. How many Pokemon with dark moves or ghost moves? So this tower could be better. I do have the bug, but the bug already evolved. And I'd like to keep the team at least a little bit balanced. I made a ROM hack of Platinum where nothing changes, but Mindy now gives you a Gengar. <laughs> That's amazing. <laughs> oh. Defense girl. Why? 
I guess my only way to fight back is to hope I get attack up. Oh wait, I don't even have to hope. Okay, well, if this is just gonna happen, gotta keep doing it until I break out of confusion. Okay, so we're, we're done. We're done with that. Here's hoping for a crit or just another attack raise. Hey! The rest of this fight, if there even is one, is going to be so quick. Did you really just try to hypnosis me? Earthquake at 36. Mm, okay. I thought that would have been later. Yeah, that and seems more like a, like, like maybe 50 or something. It's fine. Oh, I forgot how tall this tower is. There's a nurse. <laughs> that nurse, uh, that nurse might be a. Good, yes, I was going to. Point. I was already. So, I was already gonna do it. Because I did, in fact, see what time it is. Yeah, crazy, crazy how this um, this uh, bottom screen is calling us out. Calling us out super hard. Why is there a nerf nurse in a graveyard? Uh, well, you see, if you become a high enough level nurse, then you can start performing necromancy. Your healing skills extend to the dead. It's a subclass. Nurse Chromancer. I do love that lore. Same time, ghost Pokemon still exist. I well, like ghost Pokemon. Yeah, how many millions of ghost Pokemon exist? Also, I don't think ghost Pokemon are actually dead. Weirdly enough. Unless you're Cubone's mom. Yeah, that's a one-time weird thing. <laughs> One. Oh, time get time wrecked! <laughs> get wrecked, Gothita. Why do they hang around graveyards then? They have an image to uphold. Yeah, that's just that's just what they do. Like, um, you can't go in there and like clean it up remove the graveyard that's that's gentrification but then they did that they did that didn't they didn't lavender town become a radio tower oh yeah 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 they <laughs> and now there aren't any ghosts anymore <laughs> The, really the, 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 spooky, the spooky graveyard scene dried up and they had to go elsewhere. They gentrified Lavender Town. That's crazy. <laughs> Can't believe this. <laughs> <laughs> 